princess. How are you doing today? Hey, Mom. I watched another movie. Oh, goodness. What'd you watch? Grease. Oh, that is so much fun. The, the original? Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Olivia Newton-John. It was so much fun. That's a great musical. It's just great. It was weird because I didn't really get into it till the second half. But in the second half, I loved it. It was like, at, by Grease Lightning, I was I was into it. <laughs> it was very fun. Very fun musical. Well, I mean, it's it's such a, it's also a period piece about the fifties yes, yes. and all the songs. That was a really big hit when I was young. So, in my generation, everybody knew the songs mm. and could sing them. <laughs> I had heard a bunch of like snippets of those songs, so it was fun hearing them in their actual context. That was a lot of fun, and the characters were so fun. That was uh, oh they... my god, especially the friends. Oh my god. Next friends were really the friends really kind of stole the show oh right, my god right. Riz, rizzo she was such a, a powerhouse that i did not expect like her part of her story was very powerful and compelling and oh yeah I, like her final yeah. song was like hit me hard i was like wow it's great yeah a lot of times it's just the lead characters that, that shine, but in that movie, so many side characters really shined. Yeah. And the music is so much fun. I mean, it's just very singable. All of it is very singable. Yeah. And uh, in my generation, it was sung a lot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and Olivia and John, her voice is just so nice. Yes, it is. I really, I, I just always loved her voice. And uh, John Travolta is such a good dancer. Oh my gosh, his dancing is great. He's, he's a, I mean, you can see in Saturday Night Fever, how he got into that, but um, uh, he's just such a, a natural dancer. But I love how they both switch roles at the end. It, you know, yes, oh, that was to awesome. appease the other, right, right. So there's like, okay, in order for me to make her happy, I've got to be more of a good guy, and I've got to be more of a bad girl to make him happy. And <laughs> it's very cute how they they're gonna kind of meet in the middle. So yeah, that was a very fun uh, final uh, sequence. It was just. They're, they're, they they had lovely chemistry. It was very sweet, very wholesome. Uh, I, I liked their chemistry. That's one of those benchmark musicals you must see. Yeah. Because it's very part of uh, pop culture. And, um, well, you know, my favorite year for, for cars, oh, oh. For the designs are the 50s. So I love all the classic cars. Oh, that. the cars are it. great. There's so many that I love. And then, like, nowadays, all the cars look exactly the same. Yeah, you, oh, this car is 100,000, but it looks the same as, as the 10,000 Kia. You know, they all look exactly, they're nothing, they don't have character and personality. And the cars in the, the 50s had that, and I, I, I miss that on cars. Mm. Really miss it. I think it, it's adorable. I mean, there's no way you can drive down the road and some classic 50s car drives by and you're just like, oh my God, that's so adorable. <laughs> At least that happens to me. <laughs>